this video we will uh, discuss divisibility of numbers okay so in last video we talk uh, what is uh, multiple uh, what is factors then what is prime number composite number i hope you understand that uh, factor multiple and uh, prime numbers and composite numbers so in this video we will discuss divisibility of numbers so if you have any number how you can say this number uh, can divisible by this number example you know factors you know, uh, if you have any number we can find factors so how what is the factor so which number divides completely uh, without remainder so we call it as a factor so if example if you take 12 it has been talked already 12 is a number if you want to find out the factor what are the factors of 12 simply you can say because 6 2 is a 12 you know very well why because 6 and 2 both are factors if you these two pairs if you multiply the multiple uh, is 12 so completely it can uh, divide this number if 6 and 2 both number if you see in the multiple of 6 no 1 6 is 6 2 6 are 12 then 3 6 are 18 this is the multiple and so on if you see in 2 2 2 are uh, 1 2 is 2 2 are 4 then 8 then 12 then 12 so each and every number is a factors it's a multiple no so we can say 6, uh, six also one of the factor so when we multiple uh, find the multiple of 6 we get 12 when we find the multiple of 2 then we get uh, 12 so this both factors are uh, factors of 12 so uh, now we can say 6, uh, six and 2 both are we can uh, uh, divide by 12 uh, without reminder without uh, reminder no so we can divide by these both numbers so so some cases we have some big numbers uh, so that's why we have some divisibility rule uh, which number uh, if you divide this number it is completely divided or not so we want to uh, know that rule have some rule or rule rules are there so first i will discuss divisibility by 10 so if you divide any number by 10 uh, you can uh, find easily when you are looking number no we can say it uh, we can divide by 10 when how, how you know because of you want to know the divisibility rule so today we will discuss about that only so we know what is the multiple of 10 we know 10 20 30 40 50 60 and so on this is the multiple of 10 we know so in this uh, multiple we can say uh, if uh, any number in one's place if 0 then that number we can divide by 10 that's a uh, divisibility by 10 no if a number has 0 in the one's place example I will take one number so 1070 now we want to know uh, in this number can we divide by 10 or not how to say we can divide how no because I know the divisibility rule because what uh, says in divisibility rule if any number in one's place if 0 has no that number we can divide by 10 so as per that we know, uh, we know the place value 1's, 10's, 100,000 in one's place what are the digits are there 0 so in this definition of uh, divisibility rule 10 if a number has 0 in the one's place then it is divisible by 10 so in this number 1070 in one's place what is the digit are there 0 so we can divide by 10 easily because as per the rule so uh, now I hope you understand divisibility by 10 so which number you can divide by 10 you can divide by 10 which number uh, 0 have in one's place any number like uh, 1720 if you see in one's place 0 is there so we can divide by this number in by 10 
that now two six seven three zero in one space zero. So we can calculate the time easily. Okay. So in any number in one space, if it is zero, that number we can divide by ten. That is a divisibility of by ten. Okay. Okay. Uh, I told you uh, when you uh, want to divide any number, we we know uh, we know the divisibility rule. Means uh, if you have any number, uh, you can say this number we can divide by this number without reminder. We can easily say. So how we can say? So we want to know the divisibility rule. So as for that, we talk uh, divisibility by ten. So which number we can divide by ten? Uh, uh, which number have zero in one's place? That number we can completely divide. Okay. So now we will discuss by ten. So five. Which number we can divide by uh, five uh, without remainder, without uh, extra number, which uh, remainder? So uh, which number? A number which has Either zero or five in one place. Uh, in its one place, it is divisible by five. So, in uh, if you want to divide by ten, so in one place you want to zero. If the number has in one place zero, we can divide by ten. But in five, no. Uh, either zero or five. Example. So, if you see. In one place, this is a one place, ten place, hundred, thousand, ten thousand, lakh. You know the place value. In a one place, what is the number? Zero. So in this number, we can divide by uh, divide by five. Example, other number. If you see in this number, in one place, five is there, no? So we can divide by five. So both uh, zero or five, any number. If you check the number in one place, if it is either zero or five, in that number we can divide by five easily. So we can say, see, if you have any number in any situation, if you have number, uh, you want to divide that number. So if you check in this one place, first you check one place. Uh, if that is zero or five, both either any number or no, in one place. We can say it's a divisible by five. So this is a divisible by uh, divisibility of rule five. Okay.